What's up guys, today I'm gonna be getting the tire mounted onto the wheel and I'm gonna test fit it on my car, make sure everything fits before I order the rest of the tires. So I have everything right here. I'm gonna take this tire and one of these wheels and I also bought my TPMS sensor. I'll grab that real quick. So here's the TPMS sensor, so I'll take this with me. I'll get these two loaded up into the car and we'll go over to the tire shop and get these mounted up. I might not record too much at the tire shop because it's pretty much just going to be me sitting there waiting for them to put the tire on, but I'll probably see you guys back here whenever I get everything mounted up and it's all good. There we go, I got everything in the car. Let's head over to the shop now and get that mounted. Unless this isn't gonna close, damn it. When your car is too small, I don't think it's gonna close like that either. Oh, okay, Never mind. I just dropped off the tire and wheel, so he said about 45 minutes at the most. He's gonna call me whenever it's done and I'll come up here and pick it up and then we'll put it onto the car and see how it fits. There it is with the tire on it. It looks super, really, like, really nice. I, I like this a lot. I don't know what kind of wording that was, but it looks good is what I'm trying to get at. And let me just show you this fitment real quick. So it doesn't really stretch over, but it's kind of pretty flush with the rim or the wheel. So I think it looks really good. And yeah, let's get this mounted up on the car and see how it fits. So there it is on the ground. It sticks out so far, dude. Oh my god. Definitely gonna need to lower it once I get this whole project done. But that looks so nice, guys. And it sticks out so far. Like, there's the top view of it. Oh my god. So now I'm gonna start my car up and turn it and see if it hits. My worry was. I was worried that it was gonna hit back here because it's really close, but I guess we'll find out. Oh my god. I don't think you guys can see. No, you can't. It is so close. Like, I can't even, I can't even get a finger in there how close it is to my mud flap. That is insane, guys. Again, like super close in here, but it, it's definitely gonna work out. All right, guys, it looks dope on there. All right, guys, I am super stoked to have this wheel, and I really just need to make sure everything fit on there, right? And it is literally like that much space in between the tire and the fender liner, like on both sides, front and rear but it's definitely gonna work out and I'm definitely gonna have to drop this a little bit lower in the future, but we'll get there. I was looking at coilovers, but I definitely have to save up some money for that. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to drop a like. Also comment and subscribe down below for more videos like this one. I will be getting the other three tires soon, so I'll have all four wheels on the car and it's gonna look dope. It's also gonna handle really well because these tires are really sticky and I am so stoked. Also, if you guys are wondering, I got the General G Max ASO 3 tires, these are a 480 UTQG treadwear, so 
pretty sticky tires and they're also 235-40 R18 because I have 18 inch rims. With that spacer on there, you guys can't really tell. With that spacer on there, it sticks pretty far and it also clears everything. Alright guys, that's pretty much it. Like I said, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe down below. really helps out the channel. I love the support you guys have been showing lately. And uh, yeah, stay tuned for more videos like this. I am really excited to get the other three tires and uh, get everything mounted up on here. And I really want to see how well it handles with wider tires and stickier tires. There you go, guys. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Before in this video, I just wanted to show you guys the tire side by side. This is at 235, this is at 215. 20 millimeters wider, but definitely a more sticky tire, so should be getting better grip with this. But other than that, guys, I hope you enjoyed, and uh, thanks for watching. See you later.